Hello everyone, welcome back to Protect Genius. This is me Surya Prakash and in today's video I'll be showing you guys about the Asus Armory Crate and which is the best settings and how to change our fan uh, you know how to change the fan speed etc. So guys uh, do not uh, skip any part of this video and watch until the end. This video is specifically cur curated for the Asus audience. So uh, right now my laptop is an Asus TUF gaming laptop. It has an AMD Ryzen 7 uh, with 3750H with Radeon Vega mobile uh, graphics card. NVIDIA GeForce GTX uh, 1650 GDRS uh, which is going to be a 4GB uh, graphics card which runs at 128bits. So uh, like I told before this video is specifically for, uh, curated for uh, the Asus audience. If you are using an Asus laptop no matter whether it's an ROG or TEF. Uh, watch this video until end in order to choose the best uh, TF, uh, you know, the best Armory Crate settings. So, guys, uh, in order to open Armory Crate, we just search uh, for Armory Crate over here, and by clicking this, uh, you'd be redirected to this page over here. Uh, first of all, if you take the fan settings, there are actually five uh, fan settings. It's going to be the Windows recommended settings, uh, which is going to be the Windows uh, recommended. Uh, fan usage uh, guys uh, just do notice the CPU usage and GPU usage in all of these fan settings ok right now it's altered the windows JP, uh, <coughs> windows recommended settings so take a look at this and also guys just as you can see uh, my mouse is lagging a bit over here just take a look at this ok so right now this uh, page is where you are shown the frequency of your you know usage okay so it's going to be in 2000 megahertz so right now my frequency is 3501 guys remember always maintain your you know laptop uh, temperature between uh should i say it's better that it doesn't exceed 80 uh 90 is the maximum of which you are allowed to go 91 from the 91 uh when you reach the 91 degrees Celsius, your uh, system will start the uh, clocking uh, necessary. So, guys, just do remember it. I'm gonna set uh, for silent. Uh, just take a look at this. When I set silent, the stats are changing. Okay, uh, but my laptop is hanging a bit, so I'm gonna choose performance. Take a look at the difference. Okay. Guys, turbo and manual settings. Manual settings is right now not uh, uh, available for me. For ROG users, it will, it's going to be available for you. Where you will be chosen to configure the settings of a laptop on your own. Turbo is a mode which is only enabled uh, you know, when you are connected to the charger. Okay, So when you are plugged in, you will be able to uh, set the turbo mode. Uh, if for example, I remove, the, uh, I remove my charger. I'm gonna be uh, shifted to either of these three modes. Uh, the turbo mode is not going to be uh, available for me. But when I uh, once again, you know, plug in, uh, the turbo mode is going to be available for me. Uh, in this video, I'm not gonna choose the turbo mode as you know the fan sound may disturb you guys. So right now we have uh, covered the topic of the fans. Uh, the next step is that nice. Uh, before we want that. If you have some troubles uh, installing the Armory Crate, uh, by default Armory Crate is going to be installed in your laptop, but in some cases it may not be installed, but it may and it may not uh, function properly. If you are facing such issues, just please leave it in the comment section. I could make uh, a separate videos on those uh, errors. Okay, so uh, moving back to the video, uh, right now we have covered the fan usage. The next is going to be the home page, uh, you know. The home page settings okay so there are three parts over here this is one this is the second part as you can see uh, the app configuration i'll cover everything later this over here uh shot cam means that when you click on launch you are going to redirect it to your my asus store or you'll be able to use your mobile camera uh, for your pc if you have connected it with uh, you know with your mobile but I have not yet connected uh, my mobile here so I am not going to show you those parts I am just going to close this 
the third section is going to be this uh, my profile settings uh, it's recommended that you guys uh, log in and register your product so if you register your product you are going to receive some additional warranty uh, yeah that's <laughs> this thing over here okay uh, if you go to device there are two options over here system and our wallpaper this is some of the most used uh, settings in the army recreate compared to ara sync uh, this device is, contains more important you know thing uh, the reason behind it is it's going to show you the uh, the memory uh, which applications uh, cover your memory and you'll be able to free up space and you'll be able to choose the lighting color right now uh, i have set my brightness to 0% and as you cannot see my keyboard backlight uh, i'm not going to cover this topics but this is where you change the color of your light uh, or the tone of your light as you can see uh, you'll have various options over here next is resource monitor this helps you measure your resource for example cpu frequency cpu temperature and all these uh, things which is uh, written here you just click on this uh, tick over here it's going to show you the uh, stats okay the next step is the aura wallpaper aura wallpaper is uh, you know something okay i had an update in the aura wallpaper after updating uh, first of all i'll show you my wallpaper this is my wallpaper right now uh, but if i am going to choose aura wallpaper what is going to happen is that uh, i'll be choosing any of this uh, wallpapers over here which as you can see which is going to change the color matching to your keyboard or something you could you know match the color with your who knows uh, maybe with your let's say aura devices etc or uh, using aura sync but this uh, actually increases our gp workload so i'm not gonna use the aura wallpaper next is aura sync it's useful when you have the aura devices uh, such as the uh, you know some of the aura devices but i do not have them so i'm not gonna use that game visual is for when you are choosing your let's say default mode right now i have set it to icare uh, so it's going to help me do something you know there are different modes you can just try it out the game library is for the people who have games uh, i do not have any games in my system right now the scenario profile <coughs> scenario profiles is uh, will enable you to choose scenarios such as i could disable my win key uh, that is the windows key if i want or not etc uh the news is something which i want to ignore the feature is uh, for if you are gonna buy games you could you know by using this you will get a few discounts i guess i have not brought any games so i'm not sure uh as we're getting few discounts okay uh we're getting a uh, five dollar discount that's cool okay the user center uh is going to be a this is a hidden feature of the armory grade if you are using the user center you'll be able to choose or debug a lot of options so i recommend you guys just signing in and you know look into this features i will not be showing you the user center features in this video as i'm showing you that alone may take about 8 to 9 minutes of your time i'm not going to include that in this video but you may guys just go check it out there are two versions china service and Scan to rest your products and the ROG. Okay, I'm not gonna use it, and I'm not in China, so I'm not gonna use the global service. Then this is the common settings which shows you about the updates, etc. You guys, uh, these are the themes over here. This is the about over here. We'll be able to check our service version, app version, app diagnostics, etc. So guys that's it for the video i hope you did enjoy today's video and if you did don't forget to click on the thumbs up button below this video and do not forget to subscribe to my channel and click on the bell button to my channel if you want daily updates on the latest technology news and if you want a uh, few problem solving videos curated to your comments all the videos in this channel is curated to the product genius audience so it will be great for me if you just uh, leave a comment on what video would you like
next and once again thanks for watching this video until the end let's meet again in the next video bye